Hey everyone, I'm Hava and today we're exploring Hudson Yards. Hudson Yards is a relatively new neighborhood on the west side of Midtown Manhattan. Of course it has apartments and offices, but it also has shops, dining, the vessel, the shed, and the highest outdoor observation deck in the Western Hemisphere. As a girl who dreamed about New York City growing up, when I finally visited the Big Apple, it was love at first trip. Fast forward about seven years and I moved to NYC to experience the unique lifestyle firsthand and create content all about the adventures to be had here. In this show, we'll explore the iconic sites of New York as well as hidden gems and experiences that locals love. By producing this show, I'm making my dreams come true. I hope it inspires you to do the same, whether that means exploring the concrete jungle yourself or chasing one of your other wildest dreams. I'm excited to be living my dream in the city of dreams, so let's go explore it together. This is Hava's New York. Before researching for this video, I actually thought Hudson Yards was just this mall of shops, but it turns out it's actually a collection of different things, like I said. And even though it is a whole neighborhood, we're really gonna spend most of our time in this one spot because that's where the tourist attractions are really highlighted. I mean, look, we've got the vessel, the shed, and the mall right in this one spot. So let's go ahead and check it out. Right now we're standing outside the shops at Hudson Yards, which is the mall with 112 stores and dining options too. right in front of the mall and what people picture when they think of Hudson Yards is the vessel. The vessel is an interactive artwork of a spiral staircase with 154 flights, 2,500 individual steps, and 80 landings. Unfortunately, the upper levels are closed indefinitely, but we can still go on the ground level and appreciate the artwork from there. Next to the vessel is the shed, which is this really cool looking building behind me. And it's actually an art center and they have all kinds of performing and visual arts activities here. Behind it, which you can kind of see right there, is the High Line, which is a really cool urban park. And I actually made a whole video on that. So check it out here if you want to see what that's all about. The most exciting thing to do here at Hudson Yards is the edge, which is way up there. You can't even see it in this slide because it is the highest outdoor observation deck in the Western Hemisphere. And I have been to four out of the five observation decks here in New York City, and it is so cool. It is the best of both worlds, having both the height that competes with One World Trade, and it has the outdoor experience, which I personally absolutely love. So you should definitely check out my video all about that experience because it is so fun. What was really interesting that I learned about Hudson Yards when I was visiting the page is how much of an experiment this area is as far as city innovations when it comes to sustainability and infrastructure and the future of making cities. So this is a really neat place to walk around, especially if you're gonna go over the High Line, which is right here, like I mentioned, or if you're going up to the edge, of course, kind of walk around, see what it's all about, but it's not something that's gonna take all day. The other thing is, I don't usually recommend people spend their time in New York City at the mall where it has regular stores you can find at any mall because there's so many New York unique things to do here. But if you do like malls, check out the Oculus because that was a pretty interesting one. If you enjoyed seeing a whole area the way we just went around Hudson Yards, I would definitely recommend you check out my World Trade Center video, which may not be on this channel just yet, 
or definitely check out my Rockefeller Center video. Before you flip away over there, go ahead, like this video, subscribe, turn on notifications, and join me on Instagram for more daily content. Thank you so much for watching, and I can't wait to see you in the next video.